So in this video, we introduce the concept of invertible matrix. Okay, first we are going to pick a n by n matrix. So this will be a square matrix, right? So a square matrix A is invertible if there is a square matrix B. So A we are going to say that A is invertible if there is a B um, such that A times B is equal to B times A and that is the identity. Okay, if there is such a matrix B we say that A is an invertible matrix. It's obvious that the matrix B will be also a n by n, so this will be also a square matrix, right? Otherwise, um, well, we could do the, the product from A to B, but in order for B times A to be the same, they have to be square, both, okay? Okay, now, um, so if A is invertible, then there is a unique matrix B, such that A times B is equal to B times A is equal to the identity. So, this matrix B will be the inverse of A. Okay, now the usual notation for that is A inverse okay so um, a so now we can say a is invertible if there is a matrix a inverse such that a times inverse is equal to inverse times a and that is equal to the identity okay and this one is called the inverse of A. Okay, let us do this um, quick exercise. Show that the inverse relation is symmetric. Uh, that means A inverse inverse is equal to A. Okay, so picking this, we know that A times B is the same as B times A and that is the identity. Okay? Well, this being said, it's obvious that B times A is equal to A times B and that is the identity. Right? So, if B is the inverse of A, then B is invertible and A is the inverse of B, right? So, if this happens, so A will be like this, right? Because the inverse, uh, this B, will be A inverse, right? And that is the identity, right? Okay, so if B is the inverse, so, that means that A inverse, the inverse of A, the inverse of the inverse of A is A. Okay.